Hello everyone, welcome to Concepts of Design. In this session, we will see how to create honeycomb pattern. This one is circular honeycomb pattern and this is our rectangular honeycomb pattern. So we will see the easiest way to make this. So let's start. I am going to choose my top plane to create my geometry. So simply I will create a circle and provide some dimension to it. I am going to give dimension 150. Now adding some material to it so I will extrude it by 4 mm. Now on this surface I will create my honeycomb. So just choose construction line for your reference. This is the construction line and I will create a hexagon here. Okay, now providing some dimension to my hexagon of which dimension you want to make your honeycomb. So I will provide it 10 mm. Now make sure it should be consistent with this construction line. Now your geometry is fully constrained. So remove this from your base. So see this has been removed. Now we will use this cut extrude as our pattern. So simply choose this. Now go to fill pattern. And in this fill boundary, simply select the surface on which you want to create the honeycomb. Now see, this will not look like the way you want your pattern. So what we'll do is simply come to this edge, direction. In this, we'll provide a direction in which we want to create our pattern. See, it's a pattern direction dialog box. So clear the selection. Now come to your tree and right click and show the your sketch. See, I have my construction line which I have created earlier. So I will choose this line as my direction. Now what you have to do is, see, I have provided 10 mm, ten mm uh, dimension to my honeycomb, which is uh, hexagon. So simply in this dialog box, you have to provide 1 mm or 2 mm greater value than this one. So I will provide. 11 mm here. See, now this will look like your pattern and simply okay. Now it had been created. So, this is the simplest way to create a honeycomb pattern like this. Now, we will create a rectangular honeycomb pattern. So, I am creating my new window. Simply choose any plane and create a center rectangle here provide some dimension to it and yeah I'm going to provide 150 this is our piece on which you want to create my honeycomb so extrude it by 2mm or 3mm water dimension you want now choose the surface and simply create your construction line for the reference and we will choose x7 for the pattern simply provide some dimension to it now this time I will provide 9 mm. Make sure it should be coincident with the construction line so it will be fully constrained. Remove this from your base material. Now I think this has been removed. Now we will use the feature as our fill pattern. So simply choose the cut extrude, go to pattern dialog box and choose fill pattern. In this area, 
see it's asking for a cleaner curves or is which you want to create your pattern so simply i will choose this is now here what we have to do is simply in this dialog box you have to provide in this dialog box you have to provide the dimension 1 mm or 2 mm greater than this one so this is 9 mm so i will provide here 10 mm this is already created simply okay now this is your honey completer rectangular honey completer hope you like this video please like comment share and subscribe my channel thank you so much for your support